Well, Eclipse spectators at the Atascadero Library had their fingers crossed, hoping that the clouds would clear so that they could catch a glimpse as the sun shrank to a sliver. KSBY reporter Megan Abundas is live at the Atascadero Library for us this evening. And Megan, what, uh, well, okay, she's not live apparently, but uh, she got a chance to take a look at what was going on there. It was perfect. The clouds parted at just the right time, and more than 100 people shouted with excitement as the moon crossed in front of the sun. Oh, there it comes. It's coming. Yeah, it's getting brighter. So. Yes. Oh, my gosh. Shouts of excitement at around 1018 Monday morning in Atascadero, where many were able to peek through their lenses to see the great solar eclipse. Just in the middle of the darkness, a sliver of orange moon. Yeah! Young and old came prepared with glasses, cereal boxes, and pinhole viewfinders, ready for the rare opportunity. When the clouds parted, we got to see just a tiny fraction of it, which created a lot of excitement in the people here because that's why they came. Very exciting. It's totally black until this, the clouds clear enough and you can see that nice clean sliver. Through the glasses, it's red. It looks like a crescent, but instead of the moon, it's the sun. Others who gathered at the library reflected on their memories from the total eclipse in the 1960s. I have a memory of um, being uh, about an eight-year-old child and playing outside my home in Naperville, Illinois and all of a sudden everything was dark in the afternoon and I was terrified. And actually what we used was we used uh, old negatives from film, film negatives. That's what we were looking through. <laughs> and you could just see the corona a little bit anyway of the sun and that was it. As the show in the sky dazzled millions across America, most say it was worth it. That three seconds was thrilling. It's Two women I spoke with from Pismo Beach said they have decided they're taking a trip to Chile for the 2019 total solar eclipse in South America. In Atascadero, I'm Megan Abundis, KSBY News.